Yeah. Uh, For a while, I felt like if I change. It was a good video. You know, give it a give it a high score. Good things. You know, if he felt like he needed to say it, he needed to say it, man. It's his video, his content, his life, how he feels about his previous content. I think a lot of people need to just calm the fuck down. Uh, I'm moving all over my microphone. I feel like people just need to relax a little bit overall. Like, does it really affect your day-to-day -day that he apologized for saying the N-word in the past? Like, I really feel like it doesn't. Um, and if it does, that's weird. Am I? I don't know. That feels weird to me if that does deeply affect your day-to-day. -day. Uh, where the apology, I think, pisses off a lot of, like, people, you know what I mean, is where they're... They, f they feel like he's calling them basement dwellers because they used to watch iDubs, which is, like, shock. It's, like, initially, if you watch it and you're just in your feelings and you're trying to get butt hurt, you're like, he's talking about me. I'm not a fucking base Dude, it's calm down. You know what I mean? I had to say that to myself for a second. I was like, hey, man, what the fuck's your problem, dude? And then I was like, okay, well, I don't actively actually say that all the time, so it doesn't really... Yeah, there's, like, the content cop on ta Tana, Tana, what the fuck am I, uh, step, no, is, no, that one is definitely, you watch back on it now, and you're like, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you know what I mean? It gives you a bit of a, it's a bit cringe, isn't it? Like, it's, it's, mm -hmm. I think some of the other ones, though, like Keemstar one, that one wasn't, is that as bad? I don't know, can I guess I should watch it back to remember, but, um, but, like, people who just, well, I was here for, like, the unboxings. I love the mail videos where you'd, like, throw shit at his wall. Those were fun. Were those, like, those weren't <laughs> just racist, you know what I mean? I, feel, I didn't feel like watching those. I wanted to go put a hood on and yell it, you know? Like, I, I you know, I don't. That's yeah. That's my one take. I'm like all. That's from the trailer. All the content wasn't all on that page. I, you know, ultimately it doesn't affect my day to day. And I'm just gonna keep playing Zelda because what drama YouTube's weird. How does this affect so many people this deeply? Is where I'm at. I'm just kind of confused because I'm like, is this really that big? A hey, I watched it. I was like, oh, okay, cool. Good apology. People are pissed. Like, so mad. Like, at this video? Did he make something in between this? Is it because the one thing? I don't know. You know, I, I'm not into all the business. It's too much. I have my own life to live out here. And I'm stressed about that. You know what I mean? Shit. Who has this much time to, like, I gotta go to work, you know, not today, thankfully, but my cat, you know, I have issues with my cat right now, he got bit on the butt by a dog, so I'm worried about that, I got, I yes, don't want to play Zelda, but I'm worried about my cat eating, and I got shit to do, bro, who's wor who's this deeply affected, where it, like, no, my day-to-day -day is changing now, because I dub said this, like, who? Has he even been... I don't know. I haven't even been watching. I, he might have been cranking out videos lately that have just... He's been too woke or something. I don't know what's going on. I am just trying to take this hot topic moment and churn free views out of it. That's all I'm doing. Please, subscribe to my Twitch. I need money to pay for my cat. Twitch.tv forward slash yes, it's super. we out here <laughs> you know like uh, give me hot button topics i'll talk about them for, give my hot takes here i miss youtube where it felt less corporate i guess but also like that's i guess that's it, it I, I don't know same with like twitch where it feels like now everybody's like just on it happens sometimes during Fortnite and prime subs where everybody swapped from like chilling, like 
it was more realistic for you to stream just to hang out than it is now because every time you stream now you got a bunch of 13 year olds coming in saying you want to be like the next fucking xqc or whoever's big at the time you know what i mean if you're talking politics they're like all oh, these guys want to be hassan or if you're on youtube doing whatever ludwig does you're this guy wants to be ludwig you know i don't watch youtube streams man I, they need a better but better interface or i'm just lazy i'm honestly just a piece of shit it's not he's great content out here I, youtube's recommendations has gone so bad it's just like the last four videos i've watched and then it doesn't recommend anything i'm like bro my account is years old there should be like recommendations from i used to watch idubs i don't get him recommended this wasn't recommended and it's number whatever and trending why is this not you know what i mean i used to watch tons of videos and my recommendation on youtube bro i feel like there's other things to talk about than a guy saying hey you know it's probably wrong that i used to spam the n-word hey you're probably right <laughs> can we talk about the recommendation tab now like it's all fucked up and i'm not getting the right videos recommended it's annoying i should be getting more stuff in here Am I the only one, like, annoyed by that? I don't know. It just feels so much more busted than it's felt. Like, like it's so easy to not be angry about this. I don't... I don't get why people are so mad. I don't know. I'm going to try to think of a clickbaity title, and then I'm going to not edit this all at all, and I'm just going <laughs> to put it on there. And uh, if it doesn't get views, I'm just going to delete it. <laughs> gang shit. Yo, by the way, donate to my Twitch. I'm gonna use the money for my cat. Thank you. Bye.